and welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is going to be the disneyland paris tag i saw this tag by other disney youtubers and i thought it was a fun idea to also film one as maybe some of you guys know uh, we're supposed to go to disneyland paris uh, this april but of course the virus happened so Disneyland Paris is closed at the moment, which is so sad. But because I don't have Disneyland Paris vlogs uh, this year, I thought I'd do some other fun uh, Disney videos. So for today's video, it's going to be a uh, tag. If you are also a YouTuber and you also like to do this tag, uh, feel free to do it. I got the questions uh, from So Helena and Martin and um yes i will put the questions down in the description box so you can do them as well and of course if you're new here on my channel don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any new videos i make a lot of uh, vlogs and um, beauty related videos and also disney so if you like that make sure you do that and of course i also have an instagram where you can follow me and now let's get started with the questions so the first question is when was your first trip and how many times have you been? So our first trip was in uh, 2000 and when I say that I feel really old. We are in 2020 now and 2000 seemed like such a long time ago. But yes we went in uh, 2000 for my father's uh, 50th birthday. And that's why we're supposed to go this year for his 70th birthday party. And yes, we feel really sad that this year is uh, unfortunately cancelled. But hopefully we will go uh, next year. But yes, we went in 2000. And I've been to Disneyland Paris for, let me see, 2000. We went the first time, um, I guess now eight times. Sorry, that took me a minute. I guess now we've been to Disney, uh, Disneyland Paris eight times. So I feel really fortunate and lucky that we've been so many times because it's my happy place. And uh, yes, I guess seven or eight times, something like that. What Disney hotels have you stayed in? One you haven't stayed in that you like to. So um, I've stayed in uh, Hotel Cheyenne, Hotel Santa Fe, uh, Newport Bay, and also a Disney partner hotel, um, the Dream Castle. It was like the King Arthur uh, team. And Disney Crockett Ranch, which is basically also a Disney hotel, but it's like a bungalow. But uh, it is from the uh, Disney company. And the hotel I really like to stay in is obviously the Disneyland Paris Hotel. It's the most gorgeous hotel. It's in front of the uh, Disney park and it's all pink and really my aesthetic. And I just, yeah, it's just a dream of mine to stay uh, there one day. But it's just so, so expensive. So I'm not really sure if it's happened one day. But who knows, it's uh, it's really a dream. What is your favorite restaurant? So the last few times when we went to Disneyland, we um, booked like a meal plan. So we ate uh, by a lot of buffet restaurants. And my favorite of the buffet restaurants is I think Plaza Gardens or Agraba. Plaza Gardens is also near the castle. It's a really nice location if the... Um, a parade is on you can watch it also from there and the food is really nice as well you got a little bit of a mix from a lot of different uh, kind of foods there so the agraba restaurant is also really really good especially the atmosphere there you are like in the aladdin movie it, the theme is just on point there and the food is really delicious as well you got a lot of Middle Eastern food and I'm living in Turkey and it's also a lot of Turkish food and also a lot of sweets like baklava and um, yes, it's really nice there. It's not the best place for fussy eaters. So if you don't, if you are not really adventurous with food, I wouldn't recommend uh, Agraba. Then you can better go to Plaza Gardens. But if you are also a vegan, Agraba is really good for you because my sister is a vegan and Agraba they have just the most choice, I guess, from all of the um, uh, restaurants. So yeah, those two are my favorites. The next question is a restaurant you like to eat in that you haven't uh, yet. So I guess that has to be the restaurant in uh, the Disney Hotel uh, in Vengeance. Inventions? Inventions. I believe it's Inventions. The restaurant in the uh, Disney Hotel. It's like a character uh, dinner, but it's really expensive. Um, so I'm not really sure if we will able to do that one day. 
but um, yes I would really like to do that and maybe also the breakfast with the princesses I would also like to do and also um, the restaurant near the Pirates of the Caribbean it looks really nice and it's just near the right really dark and um, and they got a lot of seafood there I guess but um, yes that one looks also really nice your favorite quick service fast food so I really like Casey's Corner they got the most delicious hot dogs and it's also on the main street and they got a lot of like chips and hot dogs, uh, chicken nuggets. So if you like something fast, you can go there. The hot dogs are really delicious. So um, yes, that's my favorite quick service fast food. What's your favorite shop? So my favorite shop has to be the world of Disney in the Disney Village. You just have everything there and it's so beautiful over there. You you got amazing uh, decorations there and uh, they have everything a lot of plushes a lot of pins as well um, they also have a lot of great deals there if you like to do a little bit of shopping definitely go to the world of Disney and it's in the Disney village and you can't miss it it's just a really big shop I think it's the biggest one so um, yes that's my favorite show your favorite season or event so the last few times we went always in October and in October is of course Halloween season and I think the Halloween season is a really nice season to go we always go in the beginning of October and it's also not too busy then so if you like to go with the Halloween season I recommend you go in the beginning of October but yes I really love the Halloween season a lot of villains are out uh, you can meet them and uh, you have a really nice Halloween show and of course the parade, special Halloween parade so that is really nice but one season I haven't go to yet that um, I really want to go to is the Lion King season and I really hope we will be able to go one day uh, during the Lion King season because it looks absolutely amazing the shows look really nice and you have like a special like jungle uh, vibe parade and I would really like to go during that uh, season Disneyland Paris or Walt Disney Studios so uh, that's the easy one obviously the Disneyland uh, park it's just the classic park and of course Walt Disney Studios have some really nice rides like um, Ratatouille is one of my favorite rides but obviously the Disneyland park because it's just uh, the most gorgeous park out there you have the beautiful castle uh, all the different uh, themings a lot of rides but I'm really looking forward to the uh, Walt Disney Studios when it's finished because they're doing a lot of new rides there like Frozen and all of that Marvel I believe uh, so I'm really looking forward to that but for now uh, Disneyland Paris Park your favorite ride in each park I already said it a little bit but in Walt Disney Studio Park uh, it's definitely Ratatouille it's a 3d ride and if you haven't been on it yet definitely do it it's a really family friendly ride so also for children it's really nice but the theming and the 4d the movement the smells are just amazing and it's definitely my favorite and in the disney park i guess it is big thunder mountain i mean you can't beat that it's just so much fun and uh, it goes really fast and it's also quite a long ride I would say like like it's not two minutes and you're off it's yeah it's a really nice ride but I also love Peter Pan's flight it's also one of my favorites it's really magical and like you're uh, flying over London it's just really magical as well so uh, yes those ones your favorite land in the Disney park so that has to be Fantasyland obviously Fantasyland it's all pastel pink and really my aesthetic and also they have like a lot of fun rides like the uh, Peter Pan ride is there a small world um, also the teacups Alice in Wonderland is just really the most magical land your favorite character meet so the last time we met uh, a lot of villains but also Cinderella which was really nice but the most fun conversation we had was I believe with Rapunzel so we met her two years ago now 
And uh, the conversation was just really fun. She asked a lot of questions and she was really happy and bubbly. So that was really fun. But also definitely uh, Marie, which I was meet a few years back now. Marie, obviously, as you can see, is my favorite character. I just love her so much. And uh, when I met her, I wore my um, uh, Marie ears and also my sweater. And uh, so I was all Marie. And she was just so happy to see me. She hugged me and she wouldn't let me go. So um, that was also a really fun uh, meet and greet. Your best character meet and greet experience. Oh, right, so I already answered that a little bit. But yes, uh, Marie was just so fun. And um, yes, I, a lot of characters are fun to meet. So definitely do that if you go to Disneyland Paris. Uh, go meet some characters because the whole experience is just really uh, nice and magical. Your happiest or best Disneyland Paris memory? So that are so many things. Like, for example, when we see the castle for the first time, it's always so happy and magical and um, also like i said the character meet and greets are always so happy and magical but one thing that also really stuck with me but one thing that really stuck with me was something that um that was not really about me but something that i saw was a woman and i guess she was like 80 or 90 years old and she lay uh, on a bed and there were like two nurses uh, with her and i guess it was like something like a lost wish um, or something like that and uh, she laid in a bed in Disneyland and there were like nurses with her and it was just so touching to see like that she go for the last time to Disneyland Paris or maybe it was her her last wish um, to see Disneyland Paris and it was just so touching to see like she was looking to the parade and looking to the castle and uh, yeah that was just so so sad but also really beautiful to see that um yeah that was her last wish and uh, yeah that was something that's always stuck with me i guess so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you like to see other disney related videos let me know in the comments down below don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and if you haven't followed me yet on instagram go do that and i hope to see you guys soon in one of my other videos bye